Criminal Code of Cambodia, 2009, Infringement on Public Security. Chapter 1. Group for Combating. Article 493, Definition of Group for Combating. Any grouping of persons who carry weapons consists of a hierarchical organization and is susceptible to disturbing pubic order constitutes a group for combating. Article 494. Participation in Combating. The act of participating in a group for combating is punishable by an imprisonment from one year to three years and a fine from two million reals to six million reals. Article 495. Organizing a Group for Combating. The act of organizing a group for combating is punishable by an imprisonment from two years to five years and a fine from four million reals to ten million reals. Article 496. Additional Penalties, Categories and Duration. For the misdemeanors laid out in the present chapter, the following additional penalties may be pronounced. 1. Deprivation of certain civil rights definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 2. Prohibition against pursuing a profession during which time the crime was committed in course of or during the occasion of pursuing of this profession definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 3. Prohibition against taking residency for a period of not more than 10 years for a felony or for a period of not more than 5 years for a misdemeanor. 4. Confiscation of any instruments, materials, or any objects which have been used to commit the offense or were intended to commit the offense. 5. Prohibition against possessing or carrying weapon definitively or for a period of not more than years. 6. Posting the decision of sentence for a period of not more than two months. 7. Publication of the decision of sentence in the newspapers. 8. Broadcasting the decision of sentence by all means of audiovisual communications for a period of not more than eight days. Chapter 2. Offenses relating to weapons, ammunitions, and explosives. Article 497. Producing or trafficking weapons, explosives, or similar objects. Production, importation, exportation, and stocking of weapons, all kind of ammunitions and explosives, without authorization from competent authorities is punishable by an imprisonment from five years to ten years. Weapons refer to all kinds of guns that are produced or modified or assembled with which killing or injuring or damaging properties can be carried out. All kinds of ammunitions and explosives refer to equipment or materials that are produced or modified with which killing or injuring or damaging properties can be carried. All kinds of chemical weapons, biological weapons, or other ammunitions containing chemical and biological substances refer to substances that are produced or modified or assembled to endanger health, life or properties and environment. Article 498, Production or Trafficking of Other Assaulting Weapons Production, importation, exportation, and stocking of other assaulting weapons such as bayonets or brass knuckles for killing or injuring without authorization from competent authorities is punishable by an imprisonment from two years to five years and a fine from four million reals to ten million reals. Article 499 carrying or transporting weapons without authorization. Any person, outside of his, her residence, carries or transports, without authorization from competent authorities, a weapon, the ammunition, or an explosive device is punishable by an imprisonment from six months to three years and a fine from one million reals to six million reals. Any person, outside of his, her residence, carries or transports a weapon falling into the scope of enforcement of Article 500, production or trafficking of other assaulting weapons, is punishable by the same penalties. Article 500, Abandoning of Weapons in Public Places 
The acts of abandoning in public place or a place that is accessible by the public a weapon or any other object that presents a danger to persons is punishable by an imprisonment from six months to three years and a fine from one million reals to six million reals. Article 501, Additional Penalties, Categories and Duration For the offenses laid out in the present chapter, the following additional penalties may be pronounced. 1. Deprivation of certain civil rights definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 2. Prohibition against pursuing a profession during which time the crime was committed in course of or during the occasion of pursuing of this profession definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 3. Prohibition against taking residency for a period of not more than 10 years for a felony or for a period of not more than 5 years for a misdemeanor. 4. Prohibition against leaving the territory of the Kingdom of Cambodia for a period of not more than 5 years. 5. For a convicted foreigner, prohibition against entering or taking residency in the Kingdom of Cambodia, definitively, or for a period of not more than five years. 6. Confiscation of any instruments, materials, or any objects which have been used to commit the offense or were intended to commit the offense. 7. Confiscation of one or several vehicles belonging to the convicted person. 8. Prohibition against possessing or carrying weapon definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 9. Posting the decision of sentence for a period of not more than two months. 10. Publication of the decision of sentence in the newspapers. 11. Broadcasting the decision of sentence by all means of audiovisual communications for a period of not more than eight days. Article 502. Confiscation in case of abandoning weapons in public places. For the offense specified in Article 500, abandoning weapons in public places, the court may order a confiscation of the weapon or an object that presents a danger to persons. Chapter 3. Provocation to Commit Offenses. Article 503. Conditions for Existence of Provocation. For the purpose of enforcement of the present chapter, the provocation is punishable when it is committed. 1. By speeches, of any kind whatsoever, pronounced in a public place or in any public meeting. 2. By writing or sketches, of any kind whatsoever, distributed in public or exposed to the sights of the public. 3. By any means of audiovisual communications for the public. Article 504. Provocation to Commit Crimes. The act of direct provocation aimed at committing a felony by one of the means specified in Article 503, Conditions for Existence of Provocation, is punishable by an imprisonment from six months to two years and a fine from one million reals to four million reals, if the provocation produced no effect. Article 505, Provocation to Commit Discrimination. The act of direct provocation by one of the means specified in Article 503, conditions for existence of provocation, hinting a discrimination, malice or violence against a person or a group of persons, because of their belonging to or non-belonging to an ethnicity, a nationality, a race or a specific religion, is punishable by an imprisonment from one year to three years and a fine from two million reals to six million reals if the provocation produced no effect. Article 506, Provocation Through Media The offenses specified in the present chapter, committed through media, are subject to the provisions of the press law. Article 507, Additional Penalties, Categories and Duration for the crimes laid out in the present chapter, the following additional penalties may be pronounced. 1. Deprivation of certain civil rights definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 2. Prohibition against possessing or carrying weapon for a period of not more than five years. 3. Posting the decision of sentence for a period of not more than two months. 4. Publication of the decision of sentence in the newspapers. 5. 
broadcasting the decision of sentence by all means of audiovisual communications for a period of not more than eight days. Chapter 4. Malefactor Community. Article 508, Elements of Malefactor Community and Penalties to be Imposed. It is punishable by an imprisonment from two years to five years and a fine from four million reals to ten million reals for the acts of participating in a group or a knockout agreement established in order to 1. Commit one or many felonies against the person specified in Title II on unintentional infringement on life to Title VI on infringement on privacy in Book II on infringement on human life of Part II on crime against privacy of this Code. 2. Commit one or many felonies against properties specified in Part III of the present Code. Article 509, Exemption from Penalties. The person is exempted from the penalty when he, she, having participated in the group or a knockout agreement, and before any prosecution could take place, has revealed the competent authorities, the group or the knockout agreement, and thus lead to the identification of other perpetrators. Article 510, Additional Penalties, Categories, and Duration For the misdemeanors laid out in the present chapter, the following additional penalties may be pronounced. 1. Deprivation of certain civil rights definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 2. Prohibition against pursuing a profession during which time the crime was committed in course of or during the occasion of pursuing of this profession definitively or for a period of not more than five years. 3. Prohibition against taking residency for a period of not more than 10 years for a felony or for a period of not more than 5 years for a misdemeanor. 4. Confiscation of any instruments, materials, or any objects which have been used to commit the offense or were intended to commit the offense. 5. Prohibition against possessing or carrying weapon definitively or for a period of not more than 5 years. 6. Posting the decision of sentence for a period of not more than two months. 7. Publication of the decision of sentence in the newspapers. 8. Broadcasting the decision of sentence by all means of audiovisual communications for a period of not more than eight days.